you feeling? I'm good. You good? Oh, it smells. It's the cruise smell. Oh wow, what's inside, girl? Guys, how stunning is this? <laughs> This vlog's gonna be frantic. It's just gonna be like, ah, without baggage. <laughs> Hi guys, we here from Mummy of Waters Disney, and we're very excited. We are literally in the terminal, about to embark the Disney dream. Excitement doesn't quite cover it. Doesn't quite cover it. Oh, time to get the passports out. Okay, you're gonna have to forgive the level of excitement, um, and therefore the small amount of sense I might be making. Um, we have arrived, it is 12.29 and we've got a 12.30 port arrival time. I think a lot of people are showing up before their port arrival time, which is why there's a bit of a, a queue. Um, so we've just been put into the concierge lane and I think that just means the people that are actually at their correct port arrival time. Yeah. Is that right? Uh, so we are about to board the dream. We're going to take you along with us for the whole thing. We're going through, we're going through. Hi! <laughs> <gasps> so exciting! So exciting! Gorgeous! <laughs> Look at you all! Thank you! Oh, you're just. So, we're here at the Queen Elizabeth II cruise terminal, which is actually a different cruise terminal to when we sailed last time, when we sailed on the Magic back in 2021. The big difference between when we sailed on the Magic is we don't have to do COVID tests. We did have to do a fill in a questionnaire, like they emailed us something, we had to answer three questions about whether anyone had sickness symptoms, COVID symptoms, or was over 24 weeks pregnant, and that was it. So it's really nice not having that stress factor because that was a kind of stressful time, yeah. wasn't it? Yeah. That was a very stressful time. So it's like, bye-bye stress, hello excitement now, hello excitement. Someone's what can you say? Daisy lounge vibe. No way, no way, someone's got a daisy lounge vibe. It's just, the excitement levels amongst us are just next level. And I'm not just talking about myself. Everybody's excited, aren't they? Even Daddy's excited. That's his excited face. <laughs> Come on. That's as excited as he gets. Okay, for him, that's really excited. So obviously, it's a lot busier than on the COVID cruise. A lot more queuing. But then it is a nice, clean terminal. We are indoors. Very different to the last one. I think the last time we were queuing, the first queue was the test, wasn't it? The big yeah. queue for the test. And, but it felt a lot more industrial, didn't it? More like um, like a warehouse, the last cruise terminal, where they had us doing the tests. Yeah. Remember? I felt so. This feels a bit more permanent. So you can see, although this isn't actually a permanent terminal, they've got Disney artwork of the statues on the various ships up behind the check-in desk. So we've got Mickey over there for the magic. We've got Minnie. Which ship's Minnie on, Will? Minnie is on the fantasy. Minnie's on the fantasy, there we go. Oh, it, oh, it actually says it, doesn't it? There we yeah. go. There's the clue. There's the clue. You're looking like an expert, you can just read. Well done, Will. Um, then there are some Ariel more down there. Wonder. Ariel on the wonder. Yeah. Ariel's the statue on the wonder. Donald. On the, on the dream. No, Cinderella on the, on the wish. Oh, the wish, I mean. And Donald on the dream, which is the ship we're sailing on. I'm yep. getting going very back. excited. And William has got his Donald and bag. He's and got his Donald Nemo. bag. And his Donald the Nemo. Show us the Nemo. Hi, Donald. Hey. Jasmine. Come on, guys, keep moving, keep moving. Hi, Hi Jasmine. So we've got the magic bands. We're just getting in at check in. We've given our port arrival form. Kids are getting the magic bands. Oh, we go. Thank you. And then you can rush up the stairs and Money. go. Oh, thank you. Okay, so tried to do it downstairs, but I needed two hands. Well, hold the camera for me. There we go, hold that still. Like that. There we go. So these magic bands, what you can do if the magic band is too big, this is too big for my wrist, by the way. So you're saying if it's too big for the kids, it's almost definitely too big for the kids. And what you do is you peel it off, which is easier said than done, but you peel it, there we go. Oh, I know, you pull it, you pull it and peel it. What do you do, what do you do? Fold it. Fold it and peel it. Gotta break the seal. There we go. Right. Not you can pit, you can pull the grey bit off the magic band, which makes it a more kid-friendly size. There you go. Well, that is now your magic band Hooray. to put on, and you don't need this grey bit. So um, my husband's magic bands. He needs the grey bit. For me, 
I find that the grey bit makes it too big for my wrist and it just wraps around and around the kids wrists and ends up hanging off. So my husband's just taken Zara and Bella to the toilet. There was an emergency, they had to go really, really fast and the men's toilets were closer than the girls. Uh, we are now gonna, once they've been to the toilet, head through security where they will check our bags um, and where we will show that our alcohol allowance, because we've got to carry the alcohol, you're allowed two bottles of wine or six beers each per adult and it has to be carried in your carry-on hand luggage it cannot be checked in so i would imagine they're going to want to check that um, and then it's going to be waiting for our boarding group yeah, it says it's a sign there to ship to the ship to the ship to the ship girls to the ship now Woo! nearly nearly time to go on the ship come on yeah. Are we literally just getting on the ship now? Is this it? Oh my goodness, is this it? Are we getting on the ship? We're getting straight on! I thought we had to wait in another holding area. Right. <gasps> We're getting on the ship. Oh. Frida! Oh! Disney Cruise equals Frida! Look how stunning Look how stunning. Look how stunning. Portholes! Ah. Yeah. I, I see some of the red truck. That's oh a red truck. Is that a red truck? Which red truck is that, guys? Um, the one Royal Palace. Yeah, it must be. Royal Palace. Is that Royal Palace? Oh my goodness, that's that Royal Palace. 25 on that. 25 on the portholes. So we booked this back in May 2022. This has been a long time coming. Our last Disney cruise was amazing. But here we are. No COVID tests, no masks. This is our first Just normal cruise. Normal Disney cruise. Just take a step. Just step again. Oh. We're nearly on board. I can see the atrium. Oh. <laughs> is that the atrium? That's the atrium. How are you feeling? I'm good. You're good? Yes, I'm good. You excited? It's filling me with energy. I can never sleep. Here we go. Oh. Going in, we're going in. Woo! Yeah. We're about to be welcomed on board. Woo! I like the smell. It's the cruise smell. It smells like the cruise. It's we're on the ship. We're on the ship. And we've just bumped into Claire and family. Hi. And this is her fifth Disney cruise. So you've got to do one more now because then you're gold. Gold next one. Gold next one. Yeah. Gold. So you've got to book another one. Don't forget to do a placeholder if we leave. Yeah, definitely. Yes, definitely. What are you most looking forward to on the ship? Especially the 25th anniversary. Yeah, all of the new stuff. Me too. And all the food. All the food all and the show. Yeah. So thanks so much for talking to me. Say hi. Bye. Bye. Disney Dreams, oh, yes, welcome aboard, the Elves family. Ready, friends, up first one. Disney Dreams, please welcome aboard the Fantasy Again family. Hey, buddy. Hey. One, two. We just bumped into Jessica and Caitlin. And is this your first cruise? No, this is our fourth. Fourth cruise, yeah. amazing. Have you done all the ships now? No, this is our, only our second ship. Oh, is it? We did the uh, magic during the... COVID cruise. Yeah, we did that yeah. too. This is nice to do as in no masks, no yep. testing. And don't have to avoid the characters, you can get close as well. I know, hugs, hugs. Back. What are you looking forward to on board? Definitely the food. That's where we're heading now, we're going to welcome aboard lunch. Yes. Yeah. 
Yeah. Have a fantastic day. You too. Thanks for okay. Stay home. See you around. Bye. So we are heading to the back of the ship to Animators to do the welcome aboard lunch. Now, if you're concierge, which we're not, if you're concierge, there is a welcome aboard lunch in the Royal Palace that is specifically for concierge guests. For everyone else, you can eat in cabanas, you can go and get some food up on deck, or you can do the welcome aboard lunch in animators. Oh, baby, I'm so happy we're on the cruise too. <laughs> so happy. <laughs> She's just too excited, aren't you? You're just too excited. how I feel now is utterly overwhelmed. So I keeps going. Oh, spot the head making, spot the head making. This vlog's gonna be frantic. It's just gonna be like, ah, without that good. <laughs> the whole ship is so stunning. And it's so familiar, like the magic, yet so different. It's got lots of familiar elements, two animators on the magic, and yet so unique at the same time. Just loving it. So we're gonna look at the menu. We're gonna get some food. We're gonna start relaxing and start getting a bit. Cause at the moment we're like, ah, Guess what? More hidden Mickeys. More hidden Mickeys. Should we One show them? One gazillion hidden Mickeys. One gazillion hidden Mickeys. Can you guys see all the hidden Mickeys on the tablecloth? The detail the here set. is insane. Look at this. You've got animator's palette, Animate. the animator's paintbrush knife. Also up there, there's a tape. Yeah, up there there's a tape. Yeah, up there there's the um, the film like recording. The We've got paintbrushes. It's just beautiful. And you must love this one because you love art. You do, don't you? You love it. I so love let's take us. a quick look at the menu. So we've got some options here. Ooh, gumbo, that looks good. All of the menu items are also on the app, which I have not logged into yet, but now we are on board, I can actually log into and have a look at, we can actually see which rotation of dining we're on and when we're eating back in animators. So if you haven't seen my other vlogs um, or extensive videos about Disney Cruise Line, then you won't, may not know that um, Disney Cruise Line does rotational dining. So there are three main dining rooms that you rotate through, you get told, when you get on the ship, so I'm gonna open up the app in a second, which dining room you're eating in each night. Now, what I'm really hoping for, before we open it up, I'm hoping we get animators the same night as the Golden Mickeys. I'm hoping we get Royal Palace the same night as Beauty and the Beast show. And I'm hoping we get um, the other, oh, thank you so much. Thank you. Having water brought to the table. Um, I'm hoping we get, what's the other one? Enchanted Garden, the night that they're doing the final night, the Sail the Shimmering Seas 25th anniversary celebration things, because that'll kind of all all my outfits. So I guess we need to open up the app and, and find out, which we'll do in a second. Let's order some food and then get into the app. Okay, so we're getting on the app. Right, okay, this is really exciting. We've got our list of activities, and now that we are on the ship, we're on the ship's Wi Fi the cruise app has lit up with all of the activities that we've got. So tonight, it's sailing away at 4.30. We've got Disney's Believe at 6.30 with Enchanted Garden. Is that what I wanted? That's what I just said, isn't it? Is that what I just said? And then we've got the Royal Gathering tomorrow morning, which I've booked. The Beauty and the Beast show, the same night as Royal Palace. Guys, this is what I just said I was hoping for. Yeah, we are doing, we are meeting, I said, we are meeting some people tomorrow that are on the ship that wanted to come and meet us. And then, so we've got the Beauty and the Beast show the same night. We're repeating the Royal Palace, which we said was going to be... No, I don't think they have watched my vlogs. I don't think I said it anywhere. And then the Golden Mickey's the same night as Animator's Palette. So we're back here on the last night. That is exactly what I wanted. I'm, I'm thrilled. I'm absolutely thrilled with that allocation because it actually fits all the outfits that we've got organized. Really to it does mean we have to change into the exact outfits I planned. Yay! Oh. You watched your vlogs and then knows what you wanted and then put it. Wow. Well, that's, that's good for Daddy because all I packed was five pairs of pants and five pairs of socks. You didn't pack that much, darling. I packed it for you. <laughs> so our drinks have arrived. The kids, um, they brought out water immediately in these and water for us adults. And then the kids have ordered apple juice. Um, I think William's got pineapple juice. Well, did you give him pineapple juice? Uh, yeah. But all the kids' drinks come in these cut like cups 
little blades. They kind of Bella thinks they look a bit like ice cream cups. They're kind of cool, though, aren't they? Like the soft serve. Yes, exactly. Um, and I've just got a diet coke, and Daddy of has got what he calls a fatty coke. Full fat. Full fat coke. For full a fat coke. For a minute. And my salad. For a minute. Full fat coke. And then you're having. A salad. A salad. You're not having a salad. A steak salad. A steak salad. A steak right. salad. And then we need to move on to find out what the cocktail of the day is. Well, yeah. We need to get on with it. Because that's got fruit in it. That's healthy. That's one of my five a day. One of my five a day. So Daddy wasn't lying about the salad. He was well, slightly fibbing about yeah. the salad. And look who's arrived! Look who's arrived! Welcome on board! Mimi, we got the right restaurant. I've just looked at our dining allocation. It's exactly what we wanted for all our outfits. Yeah. It's literally perfect. Couldn't be more perfect. Pidge, your food looks amazing. You know you're on a Disney cruise when you've got your chicken tenders. And it's in a Mickey shaped plate. Definitely, of course. And you can have it in Mickey shape. Well, you dig it into your mac and cheese. Enjoying that. The ketchup is going to get painted on. Yes, painted on like art. Like art. I have got the gumbo, which looks stunning. Oh, Mickey ketchup. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Yay. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, Zaza, you got Mickey ketchup. You know you're on a Disney cruise and you got Mickey ketchup. I missed these chicken tenders. You. You've missed these chicken tenders. Are they that good? Are they that good? Well, I am going to tuck in to my gumbo, which looks stunning. Mm. That is amazing. I've just noticed the gumbo is absolutely stunning. But I've just noticed I've got this with it, which I think maybe I should have dipped in it. I don't know. Is it is it bread? It looks like cake. Oh, it, it's savoury. Can I try some? It doesn't taste like um cake at all. No. Can I try? You try some. Does it taste like a No. It's a cheesy sort of. But it's not cheesy. It's cheesy, but it's not cheesy. It's not, just not what I was expecting at all. And then already our main course is here. So I have gone for the Welcome Aboard pasta, which looks absolutely delicious. And then we have got, what have we gone for over here? We've gone for steak and steak. Both the same, steak and steak. Steak and steak. And down the end, more steak. More steak. Three steaks. Wow. I think she likes it. It's absolutely delicious. You can't normally film in toilets, but there's literally no one in here. Look how stunning the toilets are. They're so gorgeous. So gorgeous. Is one of the toilets. They're actually huge. They are actually huge and they've got like a film strip theme. Gorgeous. Look. One. Wow. Cheers, wow. Thank you. Wow. Wow. Well, well how's the cheesecake? It's really good. Is it really good? Wow. And we've got a welcome aboard Sunday over here, but without whipped cream. Over there, we've got a proper welcome aboard Sunday. Is that your welcome aboard Sunday? No. Um, William, would you like a welcome aboard Sunday? Oh, wow. That's sure. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. A spare welcome aboard Sunday. Okay. How is the welcome aboard Sunday? It's amazing. It's amazing. Oh, good, maybe. And well, then verdict on the welcome aboard Sunday. I haven't got into it yet. Which one? That one or that one? Certainly looks the business. We have another welcome aboard Sunday. Mm. Oh, thumbs up. <laughs> this cookie and cream cheesecake. It's amazing. It's amazing, is it? And it's even got the chocolate Mickey thing. Oh, okay. well, the chocolate Mickey thing is everything. Zara? I already ate mine. Oh, of course you did. I'm going to take a bite. Mmm, that mm. good. Yes, I have also got my... Oh, Zara's got my spoon. I have also got a welcome aboard Sunday without whipped cream. I just don't do whipped cream, so... I have a big one, you have a tiny one. Mmm. <laughs> oh, this is gorgeous. Mine's bigger than I'm so glad we came to do the Welcome Aboard lunch. We just went straight to Gabbana's on the Magic, and this has been a really special, hasn't it? A special experience, a special first hour or so on board. Mm. So delicious. And yeah, you've got to like, you just got to love the Mickeys on everything. 
Mmm, that's good. Mmm, so good. So, Daddy Four, how was your uh, cheesecake and how's the Sunday that you're now um, mm. demolishing? <laughs> I'm just helping the kids out. Oh, it's really good of you. It's struggling. It is really, really good of you. It's and how is the Welcome Board Sunday? Very nice, actually. It's very nice, isn't it? Very nice. Are you eating it because it's healthy? Mm. Yeah, so healthy. <laughs> I'm gonna hide the first Disney duck up here. It's fine, because someone will have found it by the time. There we go. No duck. Bye bye, duck. So, animators, welcome aboard lunch was stunning. I know. Just stunning. So, we're now gonna go and find um, Lynn and Alan, my aunt and uncle's um, stateroom. We can have a little look around. They said we can have a little look around because they've got an inside stateroom, which we've not had a little look around before. Um, so we're going to have a look at that. Um, then we're going to go and find our stateroom, drop off our hand luggage bits that we're still lugging around, including our wine, my laptop, stuff like that. Pick up our lanyards and our key to the world cards. And then you want to do the Oceaneer Club open house. We want to go and have a look in the kids' club. Uh, if not, crossed. we'll do it after the Sailor Wave party. Then it's the Sailor Wave party, but before which is the muster drill, which is compulsory. It's like the safety drill, the equivalent of what you get on an aeroplane, where you know they show you all the safety features of the aircraft. They do that of the ship. Um, and then after that, we have what else we got today? What else we got? We want to do the the open house. Um, Disney's Believe will be watching at 6 p.m. and then we're dining in Enchanted Garden at 30. I just feel so excited and overwhelmed. I'm literally like. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so excited. I just feel so overwhelmed. I know we're just gonna walk into the atrium now and be like, oh look at it. I mean I mean look, look how stunning. Look at it. Hello, we've just bumped into Erin and Vicky. Vicky, oh my goodness, thank you so much. Look, guys, do you wanna open this? It says Bummy Board does Disney Pixie Dust. Do you wanna help mummy open it? Yeah. Come on then, open it up. Okay. Should we see what's inside? There you go, from the Marsh family. Oh, do you need some help? Erin, do you think you can help Zara for me, darling? Yeah. <laughs> the top? Just rip the top off, Erin. <laughs> okay. Oh, we're just, we're just going, we're going for it, we're going for it. Oh, wow, what's inside, girls? I'm Will. Oh, wow. Let's have a look. Oh, look how gorgeous they are. Oh, thank you so much. That's so, so kind. Thank you tried to target them to each yeah, child so that is so thoughtful and kind of you thank you so much right i have got some pixie dust bags and some bracelets that the children have made but i don't think i think the rest of them we're literally going to get our luggage now so we'll catch up with you like you catch up we will be around tomorrow we're doing our princess gathering and we're just going to hang around sort of outside the princess gathering tomorrow morning so if you're around then we've got some little bits and pieces for you we'll definitely that be okay way. Yeah. Well, thank you so much. That's really, really kind of you. Thank Great you. to meet you. Thank, <laughs> you. thank you. So many Disney friends we're bumping to here on the cruise. Hello. 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 Tell everyone your at home your names. I'm Lisa. And Lisa. I'm Mike. Excellent. And how many Disney cruises have you done? This is your first one. This is your first one. And what are your thoughts so far? Very good, isn't it? Really good, yeah. yeah. I mean, I'm just blown away, personally. <laughs> I've just been going around the whole ship going, I love it, I love it so much. Well, thanks so much for watching the vlogs and thanks for yeah. stopping to say hi. That's yeah, okay. <laughs> so the midship elevators are a little bit on the busy side. So we are running up the stairs. We're letting the cases, and my auntie and uncle, and Why daddy are we four. Going upstairs? Well, we've got to go and find Lily and Uncle Alan's stateroom. So come we're gonna, down. then we're gonna go find uh, our stateroom. And then we're gonna go and do the open house. The open house, yeah. is that right? You love your dress. I love yours. <laughs> On Disney Cruise Line, it can be really confusing as to whether you're going towards the forward or towards the aft. But if you look on the carpet, the stars point to the front of the ship. So that way's forward and that way's aft. Yeah, two points to the back, one point forward. Loving all the stateroom decoration. It's so cool. Hi! What a stateroom door. That is amazing. Love it. Beautiful. We have some of the little ones, but all this stuff in the middle. Love that. I'll, I'll teach you how to make them. Oh, I am actually not skilled enough for that. No, 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 no. no. The, kids the kids would love to know. I can't do art, I'm afraid. Nearly there, kids. Nearly there. 
some time later. Six, six, seven, three. So now we need to take on the fish extender. You've got your 25th anniversary key to the world card, which should open the door. Oh no. Ah, it's because I got two together. Oh. Oh wow! This is gorgeous. Wow! Look at that. So this can convert into a bunk. Oh my goodness! Look, it's a secret portal, so you can actually see what's going on outside, even though you're in an inside stateroom. And can we just take a moment for the smell in here? It smells amazing. Look at that! Stunning! It looks like it is stunning. Well, I think that is an actual live photo of what's going on outside. A live video stream. And yes. Sometimes the Millennium Falcon will swing by. One thing you've got to appreciate in Disney Cruise Line, how much space you've got under the bed to put all your cases. Whoa. This will convert into That's another bed if you need it, oh. but it will just be the two of them in here. So you've got a lovely big dresser. In here we've got the mini fridge. Do, do, do the honours, Zara, and open the mini fridge. There we go, we need to pop your wine in there, look, in your <laughs> mini ice. fridge. Yeah. You've got your TV which swivels out, Should some nice lighting oh. options here, there we go, switching these on and off. Sockets which I'm are American sockets. Oh you're going to shut the cupboard, well done Zara. Okay. And we've got plenty of drawer space. This is comfy enough. Cupboard space up here. Yeah. This is so nice. It is gorgeous isn't it? Mm. Gorgeous. So I've got to say I'm pleasantly surprised at how spacious this feels. For yeah. an inside state room. I've not actually been yeah. in an inside state room before. And then the bathrooms back here, Disney Cruise Line Classic split bathroom. So in here we've got the mirror, hello, with a really like decent sized bath. You do have to be careful because you're stepping over because you are at sea, stepping over to get in. We've still got the gorgeous H2O toiletries. They are supposed to be leaving Disney Cruise Line, but they're still with us. And you've just got to appreciate the details, look. Mickey on the towels. Love it. So that's half, half of the bathroom. And then the other half is in here. It does remind you to watch your step as we step in. What? And then in here we have plenty of shelving. We have more H2O to wash your hands. And then under here we've got more towels, toilet roll. So you can have someone cleaning their teeth and hopefully using the bathroom and someone having a shower. But you don't have to use your key to the world card. You can use any old gift card, anything like that to put in here. You really don't want to be leaving your state room the world card in here because you need it all around the ship. So that is my auntie and uncle dropped off at their stateroom. We are now going to go and find ours, which is on deck nine. Oh, we've got a we've got a lift. We've got an elevator. In we go. In we go. In we go, kiddos. Come on, girls. In we go. So excited to see our stateroom. And if we've got any castaway club gifts, William, explain about the castaway club gifts to the good people of the internet. Well, the Castaway Club gifts are, if you've sailed multiple times, you'll get these special gifts exclusive to the, the Castaway, Castaway Club. Yeah, Castaway yeah. Club. basically, once you've sailed once on your second cruise, you're a silver member. And then I think cruise number six, you're gold. Right, 9078. It's on the cases. There we go, it's on the forward, so. Forward's that way. I believe it's this side of the ship. We're in the midship. Yeah, it's evens, isn't it, this way? So we're heading, we're going forwards. Because we are, we were in the aft, we're heading the ship. Right, keep going, quite a long way to go because we're still in the nine ones back up here. And the, the fish extenders are actually fish on deck nine. They were seahorses. Yeah, the fish extenders were actually seahorse extenders on deck six, weren't they? I see our excessive amounts of cases. Here they are. Here we are. We can barely get in, we have so many cases. Nice. Speed record. Speed record. Let's just take one of them. Zara was ripping it with yours. Until we find a gift card, I'm going to put the key to the world card in. Wow. So this is very much like the stateroom we had on the Magic. We previously had adjoining, and obviously this is not adjoining. Well, we've not got the adjoining one. So we've got a nice big bed. What's going on? What's going on? Ah, oh, watch TV. This is some instructions. <gasps> We've got our, our Castaway Club gifts. So this lovely sofa will be turned into bunks by the stateroom host. You can see that will come down from the ceiling. And then this will be brought down into another bed for the children. Hello. 
Later on, I'm gonna open all the beds. Okay. So Hi. go away, sofa bed, and the more you get. Hello. Thank you so much. Hello. It's okay. Thank Hello. you very much. Thank, thank you. you. Slight difference in the stateroom. Obviously, we have a veranda. Wow. Now I've got to say, I could never remember how to open this one. The magic. Oh, there it is. Can we do it? Oh, she did it in one. Oh my goodness. Wow, 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 wow. Oh my gosh. It's so gorgeous. Oh, it's beautiful. It is beautiful. Guys, how stunning is this? I can't see. So this, let's have a look in for a little stateroom tour. We have got a cupboard here some space for glasses and then we've got more cupboard space here we can use for storage some drawer space plenty of that plenty of plugs and sockets including two USB we've got our castaway club gifts we're gonna look at those in a second we've got the television which does tilt either towards the bed or towards the kids and then up here we've got another little cupboard some more storage I believe in here we have the fridge so this is where we need to be putting our wine guys we need to be getting the wine into the fridge so then we've got a nice big bed for mommy and daddy to sleep in we've got all our luggage which will luckily fit under the bed there's so much storage space under the bed on the disney cruise line so in here we've got our split bathroom full length mirror perfect for our little outfit of the day some more stunning disney cruise line towels we've got the h2o soap it smells so good little towels that say makeup on them for washing our faces and some standard towels some h2o sea salt body lotion this just smells like disney to me i'm so sad that this is going i don't know what they're going to replace it with but i'm so glad it's still here nice big mirror hello but yeah really really liking this circular bathtub really cool and a nice adjustable shower i like an adjustable shower because I don't always, sometimes I tie up my hair and I don't wash it, I just wash my body, but they have got the, the rainfall type shower as well. And of course, the H2O. And then in here, we've got the toilet half with the sink. We have got a sharps box in case anyone needs that for syringe disposal, mirror, toilet, towels, and a bin. I love that they secure the bin so it doesn't rattle around when you're at sea. Then here we have plenty of space. We've got our life jackets, which fingers crossed no one's gonna need some hangers there is a laundry bag and a price list some shelving and a drawer safe which should be about big enough for a laptop i'm guessing depending on the size of your laptop definitely big enough for an ipad and then in here we have more storage again what do we think guys it's awesome what do we think do hard we love it putting the wine in there, then. hard work putting the wine in oh, there yes. oh yes Oh, well, I'm, I'm glad that, I'm, no, I I'm sorry that it's been, that preparing for this holiday has been so much hard work for you. <laughs> you love it, do you? Yeah. Me too. I love it too. You don't get any bunks. I love the artwork. Well, you haven't got any bunks. Oh, let's just see them. Oh, do you know what we need There's to do? No we need to check out our Castaway Club gifts. Castaway Club gifts. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Too busy. Right. Oh, Mummy's going to bag see the bag. Um, bag see the bag for Mummy. There we go. Oh. Um, can I open it? Yes, come on, open your lanyards, kids. Oh, look at this. It's our Castaway Club lanyard gift. Because we are silver Castaway Club members. Love that. And then we have got the It's Time to Cruise Castaway Club gift of the bag. I love it. So uh, we're just heading to our muster drill, which is in deck four. Is it in the Buena Vista Theatre? Yes. Okay, so we're heading to the forward of the ship following the little points of the stars i'm so chuffed i have got my castaway club lanyard and bag can't tell you how excited i am about that very excited indeed and we just said hello hello we're going to the theater which way deck four that way downstairs downstairs right down we go down the stairs practicing not using the elevators because we're pretending to have an emergency but so we are only going down. Use the elevators. You're not allowed to use the elevators in the event. Yeah, but what of, if you have a wheelchair? Well, then they said there was a big an announcement, wasn't there? Did you listen? Oh yeah. <laughs> and they said there are specially trained cast members. This is a practice. It's like a fire drill that you do in school, you know. So 
it is mandatory for every person on board, no matter how many times you've cruised, and you have to have your key to the world card with you in order to prove you have been. On the last cruise, we um, we just had to watch something in the room and then scan a QR code at our master drill point, but I guess they can't prove that people have paid attention to that, can they? Because you could just be in the room ignoring it, whereas if you're actually at your master drill, you gotta pay attention, and let's face it, you know, it's important stuff, isn't it, it's safety. What are we on, we're on deck six. We got to get to four. It's easier going down than it is up though, isn't it? Let's face it, much easier. So we are all scanned in for our master drill. We literally had to scan our key card on um, one of the cast members had like an iPad, uh, check the members of our party. So it's like a register to check absolutely everyone's done the master drill. It is mandatory. And I would say that we're not gonna rush out of here because there's gonna be a massive rush. I think we need to stay put, let everyone else empty out rather than fight through the crowds. We'll just chillax here for a bit. On these seats with hidden Mickeys on them. Yeah, but you, can, hidden you can lean back like you can lean back. These are very comfy. Is, um, the sailor wave party's at half four, and now right, and right now it's about four. I know, but they're not so. going to start the sailor wave party without some of these people, you know. But if we rush, we're just going to be stuck in the crowds. So we want to be. But I then mean, people are going to get there if they go first. I mean, ideally we want to be near the exit, but we, this is where we've been put. We've been put like right at the back. We are like way now the back of the theatre. That's fine. There's an exit there. There's an exit there. Now oh, well, in that case, we'll exit through there. We'll, <laughs> we are by an exit. Perfect. Now it's easy, to, it's easy see. to see. Well, when we're actually here to watch things, then they have got booster seats you can sit on. You don't have to do this thing where you fold yourself into the seat. It's all good. Well, it's nice. It's nice. Though. Oh, good. For now. Oh, good. I'm just so pleased to be here, guys. Oh, so we'll pleased. Take you of an emergency. You're going to hear, that's what we just heard, seven short blasts followed by one long blast. You're going to head straight to your stateroom. Where are you going to head straight to? Stateroom! You're going to get your life jacket, all right, my friends? In, in your... To all guests, you are now at your correct assembly station. In the unlikely event of an actual emergency, you will hear the general alarm, which is seven short blasts followed by one long blast of the ship's whistle, accompanied by the sounding of the alarms. Everyone's going to think of that, aren't they? Decided the lift's going to be carnage, so we're doing the stairs. We're doing the stairs. Come on, Zaz, we can do it. It's not that many floors. We just need to get to deck 11 from deck 4. Whose idea was this? Say so excited, guys. So excited. Run up the stairs with my head. Disney Dream! I said hello, Disney Dream! I'm Joshua, one of your entertainment crew staff, or as I like to say, your Disney Dream home. Hello, everybody. My name is Kaylee, and I've got a question for you all out there. Who out there is on their very first Disney cruise? Let me see those hands. And who out there sailed with us before? Any castaway club members out there? Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. But whether this is your first Disney cruise or your 50th, you can expect... Great shopping, amazing adventure and fabulous food. Well, it's time to kick that up and another one of Disney friends. Hey Tinkerbell, let's put some tips and magic and go sailing away.
itinerary, Nini Now! Now here are a couple of crazy guys who are up for some fun! Oh, it's Jimmydale! Here's a gal with a real flash of fashion, Daisy Duck! made the Disney noise honest. That's why I was wearing sunglasses actually, because I knew I was gonna cry. Anyway, it was fabulous. Kids, what did you think? What did you think of the Sail Away party? I thought it was really good. It was, it was wonderful, it was wonderful. Sorry, we bumped into so many lovely Disney friends. Yeah. We're going down the stairs because the lifts take quite a while to come. We're heading for the uh, Oceaneer Club and Oceaneer Lab because there's open house so we can have a look around with the kids. It's the only time that the adults are allowed in and I want to have a look around, quite frankly. And it's a nice way to get the kids settled before we drop them off to go in on their own and do the really fun activities. Um, we've got a jam-packed schedule for the rest of the day, absolutely jam-packed. Is anyone paying attention to what floor we're on? Deck. Seven. What's this? Seven. We Two more to, to go. Five. Two more to go. So I think we're going to do the Ocean Air Open House, then go and change into our 25th anniversary Sail the Shimmering Sea stuff. And then the kids want to do an Ocean Air something, an icebreaker. icebreaker. And then after that... It might be a tight squeeze though, we might not be able to get to it. Okay, well we're going to find out, we're going to do what we can. We're going to run, 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 run. Think of all these, all these stairs, such a good exercise. I think we're good. Daddy Fawn and I are going to go and find the cocktail of the day, aren't we dear? Cocktail of the day. We do. Yeah, we do. Like, Ooh, we're on deck five, right. Is that it? This is it. Oh, look at the atrium, it's so beautiful. So we need to find the Oceaneer Club. I think it's down here and along there. What's right? This Oceaneer way, let's try this way. Yes. Oceaneer Club. Wow, it's so stunning. Um, and then towards the aft. So we're going the right way. We're just walking past the beautiful atrium. 
which actually it's quite high up here, making my hands a bit sticky. Never mind. Not amazing with heights. But look at that. Look at that. Look how stunning that is. So anyway, once we've done the Oceania Club, room for a drink. Um, what, what else we got then? We need to go. Are oh, we going to go and watch Disney Believe? Cannot wait to see that. And then there's some sort of 25th soiree where. Oh, small world nursery, but none of my children are small enough to go in that. So then after the soiree, we have dinner. Let's go, 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 go. Let's go, go, go. When you enter the Oceania Club, you've got to wash your hands. Stick the hands in the hand washing thing. One in each hand. One hand in each. That's it. Woo! Super duper hand washing. Guys, we need one of these at home. This is cool. Cruise Line is like nothing else. So the Kids Club in the Disney Dream has got the option to fly the Millennium Falcon, it's got Pixie Hollow, it's got Andy's toys, it's got a light up dance floor. It is just so immersive, so amazing. And I know on the last cruise, the kids had to be booked in because it's a COVID cruise, they have very limited access to the Kids Club. I think I'm gonna be hard pushed to drag them out of it this time. through to the Oceania Lab, which is the other half of the kids club and they can hear they've got the animation studios, a lot more like crafts and activities rather than just like running around playing. And apparently this bit's closing in 10 minutes because they're going to have just actual kids, not adults, in here doing kids club stuff. So we need to have a quick look around before we're thrown out. So the kids want to do the icebreakers but we are moving which means the shop is open so I've left my husband to check them into kids club. They're basically kicking all the adults out and you've got to like sign them back in. So I've left him to do that. I am legging it, running to the shop, running, well, not running, I don't do running, fast walking <laughs> to the shop. Um, it is to the midship elevators and down two floors. But I'm not waiting for the lift, we're going down the stairs. Yes, we are, we're going down the stairs. Okay, I've found the shops and there is a massive queue. Don't know what's best to do now. Do I stay in the queue for the shop? I don't know how long this queue's gonna be. Um, we haven't got much time. I've got to get back, pull the outfits out, get everyone changed because we've got to be at the, house, the show, changed for the show in half at half six, which is an hour. We've got long. We've got long. Have I got long enough to do, wait here? Not sure. Okay, new plan. That queue. I haven't got time to stand in the queue. Well, mainly because the shop doesn't even open until six, and we've got to be in the show at Hubba Six, having changed. So, new plan, find my husband, grab the children's bags, or maybe just run up to the stateroom and get everything ready. That could work. Run up to the stateroom, get everything ready for the children to get changed when they come out of Kids Club. Get myself changed, maybe? Oh, I see Mickey! Mickey's down there. Back in the room. Let's get the clothes out, get changed, get the kids, get them changed, and get to go and watch the show. 
Well, thank you so much for watching this vlog. Make sure you click on the video on screen just as soon as that is live, or if you're my patron, then you can watch videos early for a little bit extra magic for the second half of our magical embarkation day. Don't forget to like, subscribe, do all those YouTube things, and I shall see you in the next one. Mwah. Bye. The shop is open. Can we find spirit jerseys? This is Carly, the cruise director. Hi. That was absolutely outstanding. I cried about three times. That's pretty good going. I'm just walking into the atrium, and there's all sorts of magic amazingness. I know you want to go to bed. Can you manage to meet Minnie? Look what's been delivered for us, guys.